Hey, hello everybody, and welcome to this episode of the Binding of Isaac After Birth with yours truly, Slow Wolf. Okay, we're going, but we're still doing speed training effectively, where we are going in, we're playing the game, and we're playing as Isaac, and we're just going about as fast as we can reasonably go without me, you know, like, uh, okay, we, if we lose, we lose, right? Like, we're just, we're playing lazy on purpose, because that level of just learning to make fast decisions and not second guess yourself, I feel is really more important than I give it credit for. Like, I think that is part of why, um,. Northern Lion does as well as he does. So we're going to take this Anarchist Cookbook and then re immediately replace it on the pedestal. Reroll into something that's actually worse. Great. Okay, best friend can stay there for the rest of the game. And I won't care. We, got, we probably could have used it, the, the Anarchist Cookbook in that room. But again, I'm not min-maxing today. I'm not min-maxing any day. Shit. Damage is bad. Is this an XL floor? No. Okay, good. Then we're fine. Oh, I did not even know that that was possible. That was so good. Okay, bomb this. We'll wait for it to pop later. Get three cents. It's fine. All right, blow up now, please. Small rock is fine. It's really good. It's damage up that we did not even see on the last run. So that's all okay by me. Uh, God flesh. You know what? That's worth taking. It's a B item. It's a damage up. It's an HP up. It's fine. Keep going. What do we get now? Dips. Dips for days. And you know what? With the double damage up that we got going on, we're actually already one-shotting these guys, which is astounding to me. It's a... It's a neat feeling to be like, you know what, for once in my life, I think I'll take it. Uh, okay, we gotta take this thing out. There we go. Go for this boss fight. The boss fight is Larry Jr. You know what? Larry Jr. suck my dong long. What's a dong long? It's, uh, it's a sub, actually, at Subway. You can buy it. It's uh, based off of the church bell, hence the dong, uh, and it's long. So it's, it's like a bell-shaped bun. And uh, it's got a very long pickle inside of it with uh, two ball-shaped things at the end of it. Look, we have no things going for us in terms of HP outside of this uh, fat mushroom. But you know what? Fine. We're heading down to the next floor. All we need is one spirit heart, and we should be fine. If we play well, this run goes well from here on out. That's effectively what I'm understanding out of this. And you know what? I will take the time to quickly shoot these fires, because if NL can do that on occasion, then so can I. The chances of us getting a spirit heart out of these fires is ridiculously low, but hey, look at me not giving a shit. All right, look at me giving a shit currently, because we are currently stuck in a situation where I would rather not have to deal with half of these fucking things on the screen right now. There's so many spiders. So many spiders. They go down one hit, though. Holy shit, that is the greatest gift to, to man. Tears that knock out spiders in one hit. Hallelujah! Chaos card. You know what? This this spells of, of hush or mega Satan. If we can oh make either one of those things happen, I'll do it. Again, it's an if though. Grab this red heart. Cold day. And this arcade, we might see another day. Maybe, but I doubt it. We need some tinted rocks. Some tinted rocks and some bombs to go with them. Potentially. That'd be nice. Okay, dodged. Good stuff. Hey, how's it going? He's dead. Who's left? Is this jerk? Where'd the jerk go? There's the jerk. Okay. There's the jerk. Kill him. We killed him. It was nice. It was quick. Not really quick, actually. But hey, it was quick enough. Ooh, a little close, a little close, a little close. Playing a little close to the wire there, to be honest with you. Uh, we got an item room. What is it? D D7 reroll rewards. I can't admit that that's very good for us right now. TNT? That's even worse. I mean, we'll, we'll pop it. I don't know. Here? Then just. Use it? This this Wow. The the quality of the rerolls on shit items right now has been a little bit lousy, but we've got three damage ups and three items, so you know what? That could be worse. Uh we need to fight our way through this right now. Run, 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 shoot forward, now run backwards. Good. We got them in a situation where we can kite them around a little bit. This is fine, this is great. Just get the fast ones, and we should be okay. Get out of here. We didn't get hit. What a goddamn nightmare that was. Holy shit. We got out of there alive, though. I didn't see a single fucking tinted rock, though. I might just add that to a little wound to uh, whatever injury I can inflict to this game with my tongue. <laughs> oh, fuck. Here's where we take damage. No, it's not. We got through. And we got to our shop. Okay, there's our item. There's our item. What's our item? A fucking spirit heart, baby. That's what I'm asking for for Christmas. Here today, we could have done that on the last floor, but I did it on this floor, and it's going to be well fucking worth it. We've done it, we've guaranteed it, pretty much. I'm not saying it's without any chance of fucking up, but it's it's a lot better. Whipworm, 
I mean, we got ridiculous shot speed now, so that's a thing at least. We've got, like, the range to go... We are the sniper. Meet the sniper! This Diagonal Avenue, by the way. Di the Diagonal Alley? Diagonal Alley? Diagonally? Uh, the Diagon Alley that we just went through ended up being more or less hopeless. Not getting a bomb here me leaves me a bit salty considering, hey, look at this fucking tinted rock right there. But whatever. Fistula. My least favorite Floor 1 boss. Outside of Ragman and the Haunt. I, I, you know what? I think this takes the third. This, I think this easily takes third. Because of just how annoying having to deal with all these little extra bits and pieces are. And each one of them deals a full heart of damage, considering we only have one spirit art. Oh god, it's gone. It's almost gone. No! It's gone! The spirit heart is over. I thought it was guaranteed. I was wrong. I spoke too soon. I thought too highly of myself. Shit! We just lost it on the boss fight because Fistula is an actual shit. Unless if you have piercing, he is so hard to not take damage on. He's just the worst. All right, well, there goes our deal with the devil. We got Binky at least. And another reroll. We gotta at least min-max it at this point. Like, we've got nothing else to lose. We're not getting anything out of, uh... You know, not going back and at least re-rolling this fucking TNT stupid, uh, awful item into something more useful, you know? Yes, I could have used it to bomb the Tinted Rock, but do you see me going for min-max he plays right now? The answer is no. Got Gemini. You know what? That's okay. I can use a Gemini. Gemini's a friend. He's a friend to me. We could go back and do the arcade, and you know what, that actually would be wise, at least a little bit. Uh, but it's so far away, so I'm too lazy to do it, we're just gonna leave it alone. Um, with two keys, four cents, a chaos card, and whip worm, we're out of here. Has this floor been good to us? Binky's good, Gemini's fine. Fistula was an actual shithead, but you know what, that's okay. With three damage, like damage upgrades are not what you need for Fistula, you need like a number of shots. Like, that was the wrong boss. If we had had Ragman, we would have been totally fine. Like, 100% absolutely... F now you give me a bomb? Uh, 100% totally fine. These bad guys is the exact same fucking deal. They take away one full heart... ...for an asshole that eats your shots... ...and shoots in a direction... ...that you can... ...that only the directions that you can shoot. It's really bad. Dodge past that. Good stuff. Take that guy out real easy. Now... It's a little bit more tricky, actually. You have to dodge up and down, left and right. The Hermit. I mean, we can't... Can we justify the Hermit right now? Uh, yeah, we bomb for three bombs. That's a, that's a given. Then use one of those bombs for this Tinted Rock for a chance to deal with the Devil. Uh, it gave us this instead. A2. Game. A2. Okay, well, what I wanted was a Spirit Heart. What I got was a ton of money. And we get this. I mean... Might as well pick it up. I think it's a uh, reusable deck. Yep. Reusable card generator. We got the stars. Helpful. Uh, and by that, I mean not really at all. So we're going to leave that on the ground. Do we come back to re-roll it? it? Entirely depends on whether or not we can defend a potential deal with the devil here. We have not yet taken damage uh, on this floor. That is, you know, that, 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 that is a not yet thing more than anything else because there's a high chance we do. Because we still have the entire floor left to go and... This is where, you know, this is where the game gets tough. This is where dodging becomes, um, you know, more and more important. We're dealing with bonies. We're dealing with uh, people like the Stain and Gertie. You know, bosses that are maybe a little bit tougher to dodge than most. Okay, yeah, you know what? I don't want to bomb my, uh, my machine here, so I'm going to do that. Oh, come on. I mean, we got to we gotta play smart. Just take the Spirit Heart instead. Get chaos later. And maybe, just maybe, you can turn this ship around. And do something wonderful. Do something beautiful. I really want chaos. I, I lie to you not. Because although chaos makes the deal with the devil worse, it makes everything else potentially a lot better. No sense here. Okay, let's keep going. And I think, you know what, before we buy it, we still need to... Well, this room makes me mad, but okay. We know it exists. If we find a bomb in our lifetimes again, then we know where to go. Should not have used it on the five cent guy. Should have gone in for a black lotus pickup, apparently. Okay. Stain, I literally have like all the range in the world to, to defeat you. Don't make me shoot you until you die. I mean, that's exactly what's going to happen here. And I think that uh, Gemini is going to help us. 
Shit, we took a hit on our spirit heart. We took two hits on our spirit heart. Fuck me. Is this the time to use Chaos card? To guarantee our deal with the devil? I mean, I don't think so. Because there's so many more fun things we can be doing with it. Oh, come on. Thank you. Okay, now these last two should be a piece of cake. Yep, they were. Okay, yeah, we take the screw. The screw's great, especially with the tier delay reduction. So that's great for us. Little Brim, my shadow. I... I have to imagine that Little Brim's good, but it's not what I want. So we're going to re-roll it. Pentagram. Pentagram, yes. Damage up is fine. Guppy's hairball is not worth it right now. Um, do we min-max the floor? For the one bomb we need to effectively get 3 HP, the answer is yes. Is there a bomb in here? Yes! We grab it. Goodbye, Chaos. We do not need you. We're going to go ahead and grab this guy instead. Which is wonderful. So that just gave us one of every kind of HP, which is perfect. Um, we probably should have gone for Guppy's Hairball now that I think about it. But whatever. More fuel for deals with the devil later on. Slash. Hey, you know what? The good news is we're not dying yet. We're 10 minutes down. We got a reasonable uh, bead on Boss Rush. Not that we're necessarily going for it. Because going for it right now would imply that we are anywhere in a situation damage-wise where that would be a wise decision. Or that we have the opportunity to get a, chaos, a teleport card that we can, uh, you know, save chaos card with and go for a deal. Sorry, and go for a boss rush and teleport out with. Like, we need we need the boss we need the teleport card in order to make boss rush worth it right now because we've got chaos. I'd rather make hush have an easy hush fight just by like whipping a card at his face and then getting all those items as well. You know, like that would be ideal. We got a battery charge on the ground here and an arcade. Arcade says, play me. I say, okay. This is going to give us a little bit of money. And you know what? I'll play this down to half a red heart. Luck up says, I made the right choice. But will it be the right choice in the long run? Well, it's going to kind of depend on our shop. Because that's what we just did this for us. Our shop, effectively. Uh, if we can make this work for our shop, then we can make this work for uh, us in the long run. But it is a matter of making this work for our shop. We also have a chance at this boss fight room. Which is definitely worth it. Because freezing contacts are amazing. Oh, eat shit. Peep. Eat shit, please. Repeatedly get frozen. As soon as he gets frozen, we go back in there with Gemini and make it worth it. Oh, come on. You're so close to dying. Just please die. I don't like dealing with peep eyes. I don't like dealing with peep eyeballs. They're actually... Stop it. Stop it. Die. Thank you. Oh my god. <laughs> I hate that man. I hate that man. That man is not mine. Okay. Dodge the angry, angry super worm. Oh, he's frozen. Go in a little closer. Not too close though because you're a little slow. You can use a speed upgrade. Any th a regular speed upgrade would be fine, honestly. Like the belt, the wooden spoon, either one of those. I'd be okay with at this point. Grab this good stuff and let's get upstairs, which leads us to our item room. This is potentially very useful. There's creep on the ground. We just took a little bit of damage. Not ideal. Considering that our, where our HP is at right now, we do not need this. Um, Aquarius. Is it the age of Aquarius? Not without a bomb, it isn't. So, bye-bye. See ya. It's been fun. Until we find a bomb, it's not worth it. There's a half heart on the ground here. Gravy. I'm down with that idea. Um, and there's a bunch of hearts on the north side of that room as well, but it requires a bomb to get to. So, you know, bye-bye, I guess. Um, this smells like a secret room, but we have no bombs. So, you know, moving onwards. What else is the story of this run other than, uh, I wish I had this cool thing to be able to do this thing immediately. You know, but we don't have enough bombs. Our luck stat must be, like, actually shit. Not that that matters, because, you know, luck for, uh, for a character like Isaac is static. It's the same way every run. So we're going to get the items that we're going to get. And that's going to be that every time we play Isaac. And you know what? That's okay, baby. That's fine. That's exactly the way that we're supposed to be playing anyway. We're freezing people left, right, and center, though, which is really cool. I can't say that I'm upset about that. Uh, card is the Wheel of Fortune. Wheel of Fortune, everybody. Look at it be useful. Bye-bye. So we're still taking this Chaos card with us. Uh, we can't fly, so that's not helpful at all. And we have a bead. Now deal with the devil. Okay, that was really dumb of me. I don't know why I did that dodge that I just did, but that's fine. Um, Whipworm, by the way, I gotta say, has been a bit of an unsung hero because of how well it's been doing for us. Oh my lord, that almost was too close. 
uh, because of how well it's been doing in terms of our shot speed. Like, it makes it really easy to hit people with. Okay, item room. It's the second item room. Oh, shit. Just stay on your toes. Stay on your toes. Don't waste. No! Why are you taking this damage? Okay, good. Now, wipe out all the rest of the orange fires on the floor. Piecemeal. Okay, we're going to take our time with this one because we have no bombs, but we want what's inside these chests. Okay, that should be this one. Okay, bunch of keys. Some money. Those are good things. Steven. Guppy's head. These are items I would take. I mean, Guppy's head would leave me a little salty, to be honest with you, but it would be like, okay, sure, why not? Steven! I said Steven. I got Steven. Thank you, game. I appreciate it. Now, we need HP. And we will take it. Uh, broken stopwatch is also okay. And so is this. So we're going to grab the mom's key here. Uh, is that's going to make every chest a little bit better for us. And I'm down with making every chest a little bit better. 14 minutes in. We're slowing down pretty dramatically, all things considered. So let's speed it back up a little. We've been too slow. There's no need for us to be so slow in this, in this world. Okay, there's a key. I don't mind the key. Boss is... The Fallen. A, that's a free deal with the devil item. If we can just kill him without any issues. You know, otherwise it's going to cost HP because of the damage we took. Like that. Oh my god. Fear shot's fine, but I'm worried about Krampus. It's not Krampus. It's an item we can take. And we should take. We just need HP. I mean, we got the ability to protect ourselves now incredibly well. Like this, this changes almost everything. We just have to make it worth it. We've got every item we want. We just have to dodge with our terribly slow speed. We're going to go for the long thin room here because long thin rooms do well with us right now. Okay, good. That was worth it. Charge it up. Go. One little hauntling down. Two little hauntlings down. Three little hauntlings down. Lucky freeze for us, but that's fine by me. Okay, knock him out. Knock these two jerks out. Easy. What you got in here for me? Oh, God. Okay, that's fine. A bomb, a real heart. It's good. And here we find stuff. I mean, it exists. We didn't die. That's also good. We didn't die. I don't know if those were the right decisions, but those were the or those were okay decisions considering the situation we're in. Now, since we have mom's key, we can easily go after this. Oh, that was a secret room too. That was a nice bonus. Um, since we have mom's key, going after chests like that is not a bad idea usually. Shit. Um. Shit. I mean, we got golden bombs in this room, so never mind. We're fine. Okay. Fine. It's okay. Drop this. Maybe get something else good out of it. Head of the Keeper, I don't think does anything for us, to be honest with you. But hey, you know, we've got it. So I'll take it with us. Uh, what's in here? We got a red candle. We got a spirit heart. A spirit heart, by the way, is actually lovely. So we're going to take it. We're going to donate the rest of our money here. Okay, not that there's much to donate. Um, do we re-roll at this point? I mean, I know we're going to be facing a bunch of different rooms. Eh. <laughs> what floor is this? Depths one. Yeah, we're not making boss rush, I don't think. So we're going to just go as fast as we can, because that's what speed training is. Uh, down here we find a bunch of laser people. We can kill them faster with our lasers than they can kill us. So that's great for us. Two hearts on the ground, in case if we need them. An item room. Beautiful stuff. It's Maggie's. We're going to pop it. And as much as I'd love to re-roll it, I don't have the time or the or the or the inclination to do so. We've got other things to do with our time right now, okay? Okay. Besides, you know what? If we can protect the spirit heart, which so far we haven't taken damage on this floor, so that leads me to believe that we maybe we can. Um then you know that was an HP upgrade. That's exactly what we wanted. Okay, battery here says that was it, it might be a wise decision to go back and re-roll it. Go down and flip it back and reverse it. Oh my god, how did he hit us? Fucking teleporting douchebags. Okay, go downstairs. Don't get hit too often, please. Like, we've got brimstone at this point if we lose. It's on us. It's on us for being horribly bad. Okay, we're not going to our curse room. It's just not happening. Okay, we took more damage. We gotta... We just... We gotta protect this thing. Okay, it would be worth bombing the skulls at this point. 
for the chance at a black heart. So far we haven't found it. That's fine. Killed everything. Great. I'm a little worried about our HP, to say the least. Um, I think that's understandable. Oh, baby, you just protected our eternal heart investment by showing up. Thank you. Brownie. Okay. Okay, we just gotta not get hit too often. Okay, well, we got hit once. Deal with the devil is unlikely now, but that's okay. We don't have enough HP to pay the guy anyway. Halo here is fine. More red heart HP is beautiful. You know what? If we don't get another deal with the devil and we just get a bunch of red heart HP upgrades that I'm happy with, that's fine. What's in here? Uh, actual garbage. Um, that was worth none of those keys that I just used. That's fine, though. For now, it's going to have to do. Okay, take these guys out. Keep shooting lasers from across the room because it's not difficult to do. 19 minutes into this run, we're doing okay. Uh, we just need to find... Okay, that's something to find here for sure. That's absolutely excellent. And tech two is a is a you know is a downgrade. But it's gonna give us something to do while we're charging up our lasers. So you know what? That's overall fine. Grab this. It's, it's not worth it. Oh, neither was that. Game. Okay. We charged forward. It worked. Just barely, but it worked. We have not taken damage on this floor yet. So you know potential for a deal with the devil. Not that we can easily take them. Like, the only things we could easily take at this point would be Abaddon, maybe. Um, and uh, Dark Pact, like, the Pact would be good. Because it would pay 2 HP for uh, 2 HP back, more or less. Okay, there's options. There's options, is all I'm saying. Okay, grab these. Maybe bomb these for a chance at a card, or... Nope, okay. We lost Boss Rush, uh, by the way, about 20 seconds ago. Uh, we can't play that guy. Okay, keep going. Keep going. Good stuff. That was an easy enough room to take out. Now we got a shop here, and it's got Duplopia. Diplopia? You give me Diplopia? You know what? Let's do it. I got an idea here. We pop Diplopia. Gives us one of everything on the, on the ground. Okay. Which is great for us. And a battery charge on the ground. So we're going to re-roll. We got restock. That does not help us, actually. So we're going to pick up this battery charge. Re-roll that and gives us car battery, uh, which might help us in the future. Okay, grab this. Grab, grab none of those cents. Unfortunately, I was going to say I was going to use that for a spirit heart. But no, not today, dirtbag. Not today. Um, do we go after this guy now? No. We don't have enough HP, and honestly, we've got all the advantages we could possibly want out of the guy. Actually, I just noticed how much HP there is lying on the ground. Yes, we do play the shit out of him. Fuck the deal with the devil. I don't need it anyway. Let's go. Good. Okay. Keep playing him well. I like these double plays that we're pulling off here. Death, not the card, not the card. If it was the lovers, I would have been actually happy at this point. Good. Come on, baby. Pay out, pay out, pay out, please. Death again. I do not need death, my friend. I need ceremonial robes. I need many other things, but death is not one of them. You're going to stiff me. After all that HP I just threw your way, you're going to stiff me? <sighs> Bing bong. Was there anything down here that I could pick up easily? Uh... Yes and no. I'm gonna bomb this. A bomb for a half for a half red heart. I mean, is that worth it at this point? This is though. A bomb for a cent and a chest, which contained a lot of money in it actually, gives us enough money to be able to pick up another spirit heart. Which leaves me thinking, you know what? Maybe we can play just a little bit deeper on the on the demon judgment. A little bit deeper on the demon judgment. Uh, okay, we're just gonna skip all the way back to the demon judgment then, I guess. I didn't need anything else. Okay, then. Curse of the Maze. You're, you're a funny guy. Funny guy. All right, come on. Demon Judgment. You gotta work. Which one's this one? Infested. Literally does nothing without a lot of poop. Okay. Okay. Come on. I've given you so much. You you, you do me dirty? Are you a wizard? You do, you do me this dirty? Shit. Okay, we're down to next to nothing. 
we can't continue playing him. As much as it pains me to say it, he fucking rigged the game against us. Oh, full red heart though gives me hope for maybe another play at the at the slot machine. I I want to believe he's gonna pay out. And considering we got brimstone is 23 minutes in this game, you know what? Let's fucking end this one way or another. If this pays out, we're geniuses. Doesn't pay out, you know what? We're fools. He paid out with fucking contract from below. You know what? That, that's not so bad. Contract from below means that we can practically pick up all the HP we want now with all the red hearts that we're going to get. So that's fine. Uh, we're also going to grab this. Might as well grab this, which is... Bombs are key. Uh, okay, they didn't end up doing nothing. Grab the Chaos card and let's uh, let's uh, roll out. Okay, so we played that Demon Judgment really, really hard for an, up, for an item that ended up not being really worth it, to be honest with you. Uh, but it could turn out to be the thing that wins us the game. Because now we're going to have a crazy amount of consumables. Uh, we're going to have a nice amount of Red Heart HP just drop on the ground for future reasons. Whatever that's going to mean for us. Never seen this room before. Um, and honestly, we're set offensively anyway. So as so long as we can just make this work out for us in the long run, we should be fine. Now making this work out for us in the long run here is the trick isn't it we have spent a lot of time on this floor doing very little uh do we want to continue exploring here depths two no it's not a, it's not an xl floor there's not much to explore left let's go for it hey mom i find mom two is potentially very difficult typical <gasps> oh god damn bad damage to take there unfortunately oh god bad damage to take again okay no deal with the devil for us apparently the rate this is going anyway. Because mom is really foot happy. It's not ideal. She died. She gave us a spirit heart. She gave us the Polaroid. You know what, mom? Thanks a lot, you great big honking piece of crap. We're on to the womb. Alright. 25 minutes in. It's been an interesting run. We've tried playing a couple of ways here. We've tried going fast enough to make it to certain things. We have not made it to hush yet. Is that an option for us? I mean, yeah, we got the Chaos card. Of course it is. But, um, you know, we have to make it there first. And on two and a half hearts, I can't imagine that's going to necessarily be the easiest thing on the planet. Or uh, even the most recommended. Like, if we can make it there, that'd be great. But it's just not likely, you know? Okay, Tech 2 lasers do something for us, at least. I mean, while we're charging, we've got something doing damage. And that means that we have 100% uptime doing damage doing damage you know what i'll see what this uh, orange pill is oh look at shot orange pill says 48 hour energy okay well now we know but it's not what we want right now i was looking for a full health i was looking for a balls of steel um something along those lines that could have been a bad trip which would have really fucked our run but at this point of the game I don't mind a run getting fucked. Like, uh, I've gotten this fast, this far. Don't get hit by the peeper eyes. Get shot. Oh, come on. The peeper eye did not hit me. That's bullshit. Oh, this guy's so tanky. Okay, he died. We got one heart. It doesn't contract from below give you two. Maybe I've mis uh, misplaced my items. Maybe I'm thinking a humble bundle instead. Yara! Oh, baby. Here, we gotta keep it with us. This gives me the excuse not to do, not to go for Hush too hard. And if we ever see any red hearts, it's gonna be beautiful. Okay. I mean, we're gonna take the Yara for now. Uh, there's a high chance that we can whoop, drop it later. Pick up the Chaos card. But I honestly don't think we're gonna make Hush. And honestly, that's the only reason why I'd want to pick up Chaos. Is just Hush, Isaacs, you know, that kind of stuff. Two keys. Nice stuff. Yara, on the other hand, if we can make it down to the chest gives us the opportunity to do some really remarkable stuff with the d6 you know a lot of fun stuff with the d6 we go in we d we d6 oh would you please show up to the party good they all died got two keys for it beautiful um oh no big angry mom big angry mom hands they landed on top of me oh no we're not fast enough we can't dodge the shit. Okay, he died. He gave us spiders. Beautiful. I love it when there's two of those assholes. 
uh, in a place. Maybe this is a secret room. I doubt it. It was! Holy shit. It's fucking greed. Of cause, because of course it is. A um, lot of money. That's that's mighty helpful at this stage of the game. I appreciate all the dough that, upon which you have bestowed me. Um, let's go into here then. Dragnet, huh? He's almost done. Please, please, don't land on me, don't land on me, bro. He did it. Okay, what do we get? Matchbook. It's evil up. It's some HP as well. I'm okay with that. Let's go. Uh, I might have re-rolled it if I had seen it. But I didn't, so there's the, uh, there's the deal. There's the rub. Okay. Boop. Boop. Just gotta concentrate a little bit on that room and you're usually okay. I am looking for spirit hearts. I am looking for spirit hearts. Found none, so go fuck yourself. Ha 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 ha. Shit. Um, shit. No! I hate that room so much. Tint a rock off in the corner. Hide behind some other rocks to make sure you don't get lasered. And, oh, baby. There we go. Some spirit hearts. I like that. Should have yared those. Now I think about it. Because, uh, that, like, we're, we're hurting, honestly. If you get another two spirit hearts here. I'm tempted to yarrow them. It's not too... No big money. You know, big money or go home. That's that's how I see this. Okay. Actually, there's a play we can make here. There is a play we can make here. One play. Let's make it happen. As dumb as this might look, we now have permanent Polaroid invincibility. Yeah, play it one more time. Oh, that almost glitched out in a way that was bad for us. We almost got ourselves, like, horribly killed. You know, if we get more HP out of here, sure. That's not HP. That's a secret room. Secret room has another couple of people here. Okay. It gave us Judas's lying tongue. Well, I can't say I'm going to take it. Um, Do I go for the extra hit or the Polaroid invincibility? I'm going to go for the Polaroid invincibility. That's going to give us a little bit more offense here that we can use, which will allow us to not get hit as much. That's my hope and my dream as an Isaac player. Two of diamonds, pop it, sure. Two of diamonds, pop it, sure. That was the easiest 99 cents I've ever made. Why did I go down here? Because I'm an idiot? Oh, okay. I was just, just wanted to be sure. We're not going in there. It's not happening. Okay, good. Lined them up nicely. That was beautiful for us. Wow, no, we got hit. Okay, permanent Polaroid invincibility. Save me, please. You've done good work for me so far, but that was oh, some bullshit. Look, we need some damage. The Tech 2 uh, pickup here has not been helping us damage wise naturally so it's been a little bit scary because we can't like just brim an entire world uh of people apart in one second and just expect it to work uh yeah there's no tinted rocks so is that worth it no oh jesus knock those guys out of the park then kill those guys and then who's left i don't trust anybody down the lane we get our uh, lasers relatively quickly, I'm beginning to realize. We should uh, use that a bit better. Okay. Second secret room. Maybe. Maybe? No. Okay. Into the boss fight. We got mom. Hey, mom. Shit. Fucked it up. Oh, we didn't fuck that up, though. She fucked that up, though. D uh, dodging is good. Dodging is fine. Dodging we do all the time. Hey, it's dodging. Shit, that was bad. Okay, take him out fast. There's still a very high chance we die right here, and that's okay, because honestly, we've made it pretty far considering that we're bad. Okay, we did it. We didn't die. Deal with the devil. Might save us. It doesn't. Not immediately. Hold on to your horses for a second here. Now, we could have gotten guppy on this run, I'm realizing, but uh, I wasn't ready for it. Chances of getting guppy now? Slim. Both of those get re-rolled. We've done it. We've got enough to make Guppy's tail super worth it alongside Mom's key. Up we go. <sighs> Did not make the hush fight. Didn't I tell you I wasn't going to make the hush fight? I know I was only off by two minutes, but uh, that was two minutes that we saved effectively by picking up Yara instead, which is a much more interesting play considering the circumstances. So that's a dead horse. If I can land it, there we go. Come on. Dead horse. It's my favorite kind of horse. Next to a live one. Um, there we go, and there we go. Actually, not next to an alive one. I've heard things about horses. You can tell me if they're true. Horses shit a lot. You know? 
The horses are really, really stinky animals. You, you're on horses, you know what? You're gonna have a fuck. You're gonna have a shit time. Keep your half heart interval alive. Don't pick up any red hearts if you don't have to, okay? Okay. Up, I'm thinking? Correct. We got a tinted rock. Maybe this is it. Ooh, maybe it's not. Oh, God. Got a spirit heart out of that. A lot of other stuff. I mean, the other stuff is honestly completely worthless. So it's not worth the airing. It looks appealing, but it's not worth doing. You know what? I'm going to cheese this to fucking high heaven and back if I have to. There is another tinted rock as well. So that's worth keeping in mind here. Got rid of one of these assholes. The other one is on his way out. Perfect. Drop a bomb. Get another spirit heart. And we're looking so much better. Also, where did we pick up that red heart HP? Well, shit. Now we want to pick up the other one. Because that's actually going to keep our... Fuck off. Come on. Oh, whatever, dog. Cannot believe he hit me twice. I'm really mad about that, actually. Okay. Two keys. It's great. The nickel does nothing for us. Alright, my HP's not looking so good anymore. And we lost it on a half hour interval. So there's that going on for us. Uh, it's a bunch of mega fatties. This does not fill me with confidence. I am not... A friend of the mega fatty. No one should be. Okay. Okay. Good stuff. Take this out. Take this out. Take those guys out. Just keep moving. No matter what you do. Just drive-bys. Never stop moving. Because these assholes jump. And it sucks. Got rid of one. Okay, next. We can move across the level. We can move across the map. He's almost dead. There we go. We did it. We dealt with the t double mega fatty room. I'm happy about that. Let's keep going. Duh, 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 duh. Okay, we got another tinted rock and another heart. That's fine. Honestly, the half heart interval is only good for as much as we need. Honestly, that's, that's good right there. We're good. We're good. We're good. We got the half heart interval. We got the spirit heart as well. I was thinking that I wouldn't be able to get both, but then I did. And it was beautiful. Please, laser me again. I double dog dare you. Thank you. Laser me again? No? Okay. You're gonna run away because you're scared. I understand that you're scared. I'm shooting the same lasers you are. That's, that could be a frightening experience. Okay. He's dead. We got two chests. Ooh. Considering that our current trinket is useless, yeah, we're gonna take that. So this means that the chest is gonna be a lot more helpful. Oh god, that was bad damage to take. Uh, because now we're not gonna have any chance of uh, spacebar items. I really like this trinket, honestly. In, in the right situations, it's a beautiful thing. Makes the game a lot more interesting and a lot more fun for me, anyway. Oh, God, no, we got hit. Uh, okay. Don't die here. This would be the bad time to die. Like, Chaos Card would have been useful here. But we should just be able to play well enough to deal with this. That's, that's how, that's, like, we got Brimstone, man. Okay, we're in the corner. Also, no speed-ups. Can't help but notice no speed-ups over the course of this entire fucking round. So, you know, that's fine. Oh shit, other corner, other corner, other corner. Oh, we made it just barely. Oh, he's frozen. We did it. Let it go. Let it go. Don't move anymore. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, unlimited range. Thank you, Brimstone. You're the most beautiful item in the world. You're the most beautiful thing in the world. Oh, we've done it. <sighs> Yara on the chest with a d6 is a beautiful time. Let's make this happen. Yara says go. Then we're going to open them up and see which ones we want and which ones we don't. Mom's wig, I think, is a yes. Uh, Abel, on the other hand, not so much. Triple shot. Yeah, okay, I'll take it, apparently. <laughs> Got bounced into it more than anything else. Celtic Cross might save us and these two babies can go to hell. So, whoop. Okay, and Epiphora 4 does nothing for us. So we take Mom's wig. We take this. We re-roll the rest into damage. The parasite. Fear Tears. The Leech. And Pyro fucking Maniac. Mm, that's actually real good. Bomb immunity in particular is really nice. The triple shot part. Oh no! The triple shot part is really nice. But now we have a super large uh, charge up time I just realized. So we need to play it safe. Because otherwise it ends up being a huge detriment to us. Okay. This is good. Scorpio. Attack flow. I'll take Scorpio. But I'm going to leave the other two there. By the way, Ultra Greed paying out with uh, what he did there was real nice. Oh, come on. 
Okay, Tech 2 is actually doing Game Busters for us. Justice and Justice. Holy shit, what a time to be alive. Whoop! Does nothing for us right now. But uh, it could end up being our salvation in the future. As that is HP we can desperately use. Up here we find the Forsaken. He is insta-dead. Which gave us two more items. Cupid's shot arrow. Does nothing. And Infestation 2. Mm -hmm. Yes! I will take Infestation 2 and be very pleased with it. Okay, so... Uh, knock this guy out of the park, and then, whoa, a little close. Got nothing out of it, though. Take this guy out. No, not quite in one shot. Dodged his bullets, even though we didn't even see it. So that's nice, I guess. Okay. Come on, he's not dead yet? Okay, I would like any attack speed ups you guys have for me. All right, head him back upstairs. This has been a 40-minute run. It's not in line with my speed... Uh, speedrun mentality, but you know what, we'll do it. Okay, fine, Leo does nothing for us. Bomberman might get us killed. I'm not coming back here, so... It's too far. Um, uh, Leo does nothing for us, I don't think, other than give us a wicked sick beard. Uh, he's not dead yet? Excuse me? <laughs> Alright, two more items. Uh, stem cells is fine. Magneto does probably nothing for us, but whatever. Okay. Dragnet, please. Become deceased. Thank you. Uh, he gave us two more chests. Mom's knife. Great. And by mom's knife, I mean sacrificial dagger. That's fine. We're not taking Curse of the Goddamn Tower, though. Because that shit will get us killed faster than you can imagine. Oh, God. Run away from the super fast, angry, bombing gurglings. Okay, we've done it so far. Good stuff. Did we get anything else out of this? No. Just a bunch of spiders. But you're going to do a reasonable job of killing people. That's okay. That's okay. I can do a reasonable job of killing people. That's, uh, that's something I can get behind. Okay, where's this guy gonna land? There? Alright, well, he's gonna die for it, so... That's worth it, at least. Um... We know, you know, we might re-roll Curse of the Tower. That might be a thing we do. Oh, shit, 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 shit. We didn't shoot in time. Fucking damage. Okay. Now, keep in mind, you can just bomb your way to full health. Don't forget that, please, and thank you die thank you oh my god you have no idea how happy it makes me when you die that fast dongle all right dangle dangle we roll it it's fucking even worse than i thought we're taking it anyway we have all the magnets how do they even work i mean with brimstone it's actually okay because it'll suck them into the laser and kill them which is fine uh, and with all these spiders on the ground, that's kind of beautiful as well. I mean, we can make it through this run. We're not in a situation where we should lose, but there is a chance that we do, and that chance scares me more than anything. So, you know. What do we do now? We head into this room and nuke whoever's there! The, I think Loki died because of spiders more than anything else. Does this keep people away from us, I just realized? I think it does. Okay. Stop fucking screwing with everything. Uh, oof. is that Pisces? It is. Uh, I'm not sure what that does for us, but the tears up here is mighty helpful. As far as I'm concerned, very helpful indeed. Tears ups are amazingly useful. I could use any and all HP you two la lads are willing to give me. Oh god, why do we do Strange Attractor? Okay. Thank you for the HP though. I do appreciate that. That saves me from having to spend a bomb to do so. Okay, that was bad damage. Don't take that again. Okay, and more HP out of the guy. Perfect. Alright, blue baby, we can do this, you and I. Just the two of us. Just the two of us. Okay. Like, we're in a situation now where... Okay. We should be able to make it through this, so long as we play safe. And... Oh god, bomb. Bomb me. I can't bomb. Bomb. Bomb me. Bomb me. Bomb me. Bomb me. Bomb me. Thank you. Got all my HP back from that. That's beautiful. I need my bomb. Give me my bomb. No! Fucker! We killed him too. Either way, thank you everybody so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. If you did, be sure to let me know. Hit the like button down below. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Uh...